And as long as wars are started and nations are enslaved in order to win votes in elections, not only will the problems of the global community remain unsolved, but they will be increasingly exacerbated. Friends and colleagues, let's look at the situation of the world today. Iraq was attacked under the false pretext of uncovering weapons of mass destruction and overthrowing a dictator. The dictator is toppled and WMDs are not uncovered. A democratic government is established by the votes of the people, but after six years, the occupiers are still there. They insist on imposing colonial agreements on the people of Iraq by keeping them under Chapter 7 on the UN, of the UN Charter. Millions of people have been killed or displaced, and the occupiers, without a sense of shame, are st still seeking to solidify their position in the political geography of the region and to dominate oil reserve, resources. They have no respect for the people of Iraq and disregard any dignity, rights, or status for them. The UN is not capable enough to solve the problems and to remove aggression, occupation, and imposition.